Ooh, Jack, where'd you get this beat? Oh, it's just something I made. I like it. Let's talk a little bit about recursion. Ooh, recursion? Yeah. All right. Walking out of class, and I don't know why. Ooh. This recursion stuff is tough, and it makes me want to cry. I'm not sure why a function would call itself. I need this funky tune to come and help. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. While you might think a loop is always the move, recursion is sometimes the best way to groove. The function gets called and then added to the stack. Next comes the recursive plan of attack. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. Just like the bass at the heart of the song, the bass case in recursion is what gets you along. If the bass case is true, the answer returns. If not, you call the function again with different terms. Base case, recursion. Base case, recursion. What? Base case, recursion. Base case, Recursion. Work the problem down to a smaller size. Bite-sized pieces will get you your prize. Make sure your base case is something that will be true. Otherwise, an infinite loop will come and haunt you. Base case. Recursion. Base case. Recursion. Base case. Recursion. Base case. Recursion. It's always smart to start with pseudo code. Grab a pen and paper. It will lighten the load. Imagine loops don't exist. Don't let them distract us. If you stick to this rule, it's the best way to practice. Base case recursion. Base case recursion. Base case recursion. Base case recursion. Ooh. Hopefully that helped you out a little bit. It sure helped me out. Recursion. Recursion. Base case. Base case. That's all you need to know. You got this. Thanks for listening. You can do it.